The video you're about to watch is a little teaser of a qualitative research project conducted by two um, master's program here, M2 Quantitative Market Research and M2 Advanced Research in Marketing. The project was actually interesting from a humanistic perspective because we were two programs working on the project. And our job, on the other hand, was to uh, explore the different representations of physical activity and connected objects among seniors this time to assess the extent to which they accept in or reject the notion of coaching from a connected object. I will let you enjoy the video and contact us if you have any further questions, although I'm sure you will have some. We all have stereotypes for seniors. They're sick, lonely, and don't know a thing about technology. However, the overall picture showed a different reality. Did you know that by 2060, one in three Europeans will be over 65? But don't you dare call them a senior. Wealthier, internet savvy, connected, and so into the loop. And hey, they also care about their appearance to stay fancy and look fashionable. And if they happen to do some sorts of activity, they are keen to do it socially. And that's what we call the silver economy. It actually covers the needs and demands arising from the population over 50. And in order to fully explore the role of technology in regular physical activity in the improvement of their daily well-being, we married for different qualitative methods. And this took us a journey of 10,000 miles. Oh wait, 10,000 verbatim transcripts. We learned quite a lot about their different approaches to technology to keep fit and healthy and how we can be actually aligned to meet their autonomy, competence, and social proximity. And throughout this process, we identify four types of seniors, quite different, but who might have one thing in common, a relieved future. As for the story, it was really interesting to build. So thank you, Tasta, and all of the actors of the project for giving us such an amazing opportunity to bond, create, and become one.